Welcome everyone. You may want to opt out of the iOS 16 beta, cancel the beta. In order to do that, you're going to open up the settings app. From here, you're going to scroll all the way down until you see general. From here, you're going to scroll to the bottom and you should see VPN and device management. Tap on this one. So if you have here configuration profile, iOS 16 beta software profile, that means you have not canceled the beta. You will receive iOS 16 beta updates until iOS 17 comes out. What you want to do is you want to tap on the profile here, tap on remove, enter in your passcode, remove, and tap on not now. As long as the beta profile is not on your device, whether it was never on your device in the first place or you just deleted it, what this means is you will have no more iOS 16 beta updates show up on your device. But you may be wondering right now, so, so I've canceled the beta, how do I get on the iOS 16 public release? So go into software update right now, and if you have an iOS 16 public release available, download it and you'll be good to go. If you don't have a public release available, the reason why is either the beta version you were on is the same as the public release, number one, or number two, you're on a beta version for an iOS that hasn't released yet. So to break it down, let's say you are on iOS 16.1 beta 2. If iOS 16.1 has not released to the public yet, you have to wait until that happens and then you're going to get iOS 16.1 public release. If you're on iOS 16.0 release candidate, release candidate is the same as the version which releases to the general public. So what that means is you're not going to get a new software because, well, you're already on the public release, okay? But in the future, when new public releases of iOS drop, you'll get them and you'll be able to operate them, no problems. So with that being said, thanks for watching. See you guys later. Bye-bye.